Earlier this week, we had a chance to cover the Bangor High School robotics teams as they prepared for one of the largest robotics competitions to ever be hosted in Maine, the Lobster Bowl. A three-day event that began on Thursday with the final matches taking place today. With competition well underway, New Center Maine's Drew Peters traveled to the Collins Center for the Arts at UMaine to speak with competitors and learn more about this event. Robotics teams from across the country and even other nations coming together to compete at the first annual Lobster Bowl hosted by UMaine in Orono. It's a really rich environment for students to expand their, their horizons and their capabilities. Among the more than 40 teams fighting for first, members of Team Gadget Gang are representing nearby Bangor High School. Robotics coach and Bangor High School physics and engineering teacher Carrie Phipps says this is the team's first competition of the year. Seeing the work come to fruition has been fantastic. Like even over the span of the, this is the third day, the span of the three days, seeing all those little tweaks. Earlier this week, New Center Maine sat in on one of the team's practices for the competition. Preparation that senior Brock Crump says has been valuable in every match. I feel like our robot compared to like other seasons we've had, it's definitely quite a lot better. And I feel like we're definitely being able to play the game quite well for like how we're able to. While competing is the main focus, Crump says it's been a blast meeting other robotics teams they'd never get the chance to talk to otherwise. Like Team Holy Cow, all the way from Ontario, Canada. Coming here like with a 12 hour drive and everything, like we're all in cars together, it like definitely helps the team bond. Team member and 10th grader Michael says one of his favorite parts has been picking up different strategies from watching other teams compete and seeing how each robot works. Just talking to the other people, meeting them where they're from, what they're doing here, what they like. I think, yeah, it's definitely one of the best parts of the competition. Something that head organizer Michael Murphy says he hopes will help grow the robotics community throughout Maine and keep bringing more competitors to the area. It's a win for the students competing in Maine, particularly. It's an extra opportunity for students to travel that are outside of Maine to another event, a different space, a different venue. Lobster Bowl officials say the winners will be rewarded with the lobster bake of their own at the end of competition later today. In Orono, Drew Peters, New Center, Maine. Well, if those smart kids are the future, I think we might be in good hands. Well, head organizer Michael Murphy said they're already planning on holding the second annual Lobster Bowl next fall.